What causes fruit rot? One of the most common problems with fruit crops is fruit rot. This problem can cause significant loss to farmers and it can be difficult to avoid. In this video, we'll take a look at what fruit rot is, how it occurs, and we will discuss some of the methods that farmers use to try and prevent it. But before we get into that, if you would like to see more videos like this one, hit the like and subscribe buttons to stay up to date. So what is fruit rot and what are the symptoms of it in plants? Fruit rot is a plant disease that can cause significant loss for farmers as it can reduce the quality of the crop and make it inedible. It's caused by a number of different fungi, bacteria and viruses and it can be difficult to prevent and treat. Pre-harvest fruit rot symptoms include early ripening, fruit discoloration and fruit softening. Post-harvest fruit rot symptoms include mold growth on the fruit surface, fruit decay and fruit leakage. How does fruit rot occur and how can you prevent it from happening in your garden or orchard? There are many different types of fungi that can cause fruit rot, but the most common type is Botrytis cinerea. This fungus affects a wide range of fruits including grapes, strawberries, tomatoes and peppers. The fungus enters the plant through wounds in the leaves or fruit lesions and it proliferates in human conditions. Once established, the fruit infections can spread rapidly through the crop, causing rot. To prevent disease development, it is important to practice good crop management. This includes planting disease-resistant varieties of fruit crops, avoiding overhead irrigation, pruning plants to improve air circulation, removing infected fruit from the plant, disinfecting pruning tools between cuts. Here's some tips to help prevent fruit rot from occurring. There are a number of ways that farmers can try to prevent fruit rot. One method is to reduce the amount of humidity in the air around the plants. When humid weather is prevalent, this can be achieved by using fans or by spraying the plants with water. Fungicides are typically the most effective method of control, but they can be expensive and they may not be available in all countries. Biological control agents are becoming more popular as they are more environmentally friendly. Another method of control is to use heat treatments. This involves exposing the crop to high temperatures, which will kill the fungi that causes fruit rot. Heat treatments can be costly and time consuming, so they are not always practical for farmers. Unfortunately, there is no one size fits all cure for fruit rot. It depends on what's causing the disease in your garden or orchard. However, there are some steps you can take to prevent fruit rot from happening in your plants. And if it does occur, there are treatments available that may be able to save your harvest. If you're looking for a deeper dive, we have a full blog up on postharvest.com. We've also got a bunch of free courses available while you're there. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for regular content. Together, we can help the world go a little bit greener.